What's up everybody? Hope you're having a great Friday. I'm pretty sure it's Friday today. And uh, today's video is going to be all about tuning. Um, I kind of wanted to just review everything that you already know about tuning that we talk about in class. And also we're going to walk through a normal tuning sequence complete with a theme. So when we get to that part, and I'm going to sound like such a YouTuber right now, but uh, I'm going to give you a theme and then I want you to leave your answers to the theme in the comments below. I've always wanted to say that. So yeah, please leave your tune ideas in the comments below. Hopefully we get a bunch of them. Um, so just a couple reminders about tuning and cellists. I'll trust that you can sort of remember what you have to do because I don't want to do this with 18 different instruments. But uh, chin rest on chin, shoulder rest on shoulder, right? Make sure that you have your left hand on the tuning peg before you even bother with the bow. Thank you, buddy. Then take your bow, you're gonna start with an up bow. And then if you have to make adjustments, adjust slowly while you're bowing. And so forth, going through all your strings. So the theme, well first let me start the note. Make sure you can hear that. So the theme is things you can be doing at home right now. I bet you saw that theme coming. It could be things that are helpful, things that are fun, but things that you can be doing around the house. Maybe err on the side of things that are helpful. It might be nice. So let's think about A, things you could do around the house. What? What do you want? Goodness. All right, let's move on to D. Things you can do around the house that are helpful or fun. If we maybe just wanted those two, helpful or fun, not destructive. Not destroy things. That is not one of the answers. All right, D. Something other than destroy things for D. All right, let's move on to G. Things to do around the house when you can't really go anywhere else. Starting with G. Remember, leave your answers in the comments below. That sounds funny saying that. Gee. Let's move on to C. Need the viola for that. All right, things you can do around the house when you can't go anywhere else that start with the letter C. Leave your responses down below. All right, that's good. 
Let's move back to the superior instrument, uh, the violin, sorry, not the superior, I'm just kidding, not the superior instrument. Everyone knows that's the bass anyway. Oh yeah, we gotta do bass, we gotta do the bass E, what am I thinking? Things you can do around the house that start with E. Wow, that's like really sharp. If you had an A emergency, a D emergency, a G emergency, a C emergency, or an E emergency, if you really can't practice at all right now because of the condition of your strings, uh, that's an issue. So we could definitely set something up where uh, the instrument is left outside your house and I could go and tune it up and leave it there and you could come out and pick it up because we're really trying to enforce not going into people's houses and social distancing. Um, that being said, if your instrument is way out of tune, we want to be able to do something about it. So I'm still willing to come by your house, tune it outside your house, and leave it for you. If that is something that would be helpful, email me if it would be. And the last part of this video, and something I'll leave in the comments below, is the note names for happy birthday. So let's say it's the birthday of somebody that you know... Gosh, and any time in this past week or in the coming week, um, and you want to be able to play happy birthday for them. I think that's something you should do. And maybe you've kind of scooched by in class without really remembering how to play it. Well, here's a reminder, and I'll put the note names down below in the comments and or in the description below, and uh, relearn how to play it and play it for somebody. FaceTime somebody, Skype somebody, Google Hangout somebody, Zoom somebody, call somebody. Play happy birthday for them. If it was their birthday a couple of days ago, if it's their birthday in a week, uh, it's a nice thing to do and people would love to see you play it. So happy birthday starts on open D. And those of you that are visual, you can look at my fingers here. So I hope to uh, see you guys soon. I hope the tuning video helps. Again, leave your theme ideas below and uh, bless somebody with a little bit of happy birthday. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.